6 Personal Branding Tips to Build Your Network Marketing Business Online 1. Be yourself. You may represent a specific company in the sense that you sell their products, but first and foremost you represent yourself. Create a blog that brands you and make sure all of your social media accounts use your name and image. You want them to truly reflect you and show your smiling face. There is no bigger turnoff than when a person has a company logo or product as their profile picture or banner. It immediately sends a message that they are trying to sell someone something, and no one likes to be sold to, at least without granting permission, right? Try to put yourself in the other person's shoes. How did you get started in your current company? Likely you joined someone you knew and trusted. This is the vibe you want to create. 2. Establish yourself as the expert and become the authority in your niche. People tend to gravitate towards and join people who know what they are doing and where they are going. The best way to achieve this is to share your story, your experiences and your knowledge. If you're in a health and wellness company, share fitness tips, recipes, weight loss success stories, and pictures of you living the healthy lifestyle. If you want to be the go-to person for lead generation and branding, share the newest marketing strategies, interview top leaders who are successfully building their business online, and share your own results. Immerse yourself and be passionate about the niche you are in and share that value with the world. The more you consistently do this, the more people will start to see you as the go-to person for that particular industry. 3. Be consistent in creating content and sharing value. Whether you believe it or not, people are watching you in your business. They may not like or engage on every post or video, but they are watching. The more you show up in your business every day, regardless of the results you initially get, the more people will begin to take you seriously and want to learn more about exactly what you're doing. Every time you learn or try something new related to your niche, share that experience or knowledge with others. It can be through a blog post, a video, or even a simple photo you share on Facebook. Anytime you experience something that you found valuable, know that there are likely plenty more people who will find that valuable as well. 4. Create unique lead magnets or offers to give away to your ideal prospects. Always be sure to build trust and rapport with your prospect before any type of sales transaction. Far too many people run straight out of the gate instantly pitching their products to everyone they meet. But rather than approaching people you with a transactional mindset, focus on building a solid relationship where you provide value and serve those you meet. One of the best ways to accomplish this is through using lead magnets. Basically this is just a fancy term for giving your prospect something of value in exchange for their email address or contact information. If you promote a weight loss product, perhaps you could create a video series giving nutrition and fitness tips. If you are in a beauty company, think about doing makeup or skincare tutorials. Whatever niche you are in, think about your ideal prospect and a problem they may have. Then create your offer by providing them with the solution to their problem. It's a win-win. You provide value and are of service to someone and in exchange they give you their contact information to follow up with them. 5. Build and connect with your list to foster strong relationships. As you may have heard before, the fortune is in the follow-up. As you start to provide value to the marketplace and build your email subscriber list, it is important to make connecting with those people a habit. Write to your list when you have something valuable to share like a new blog post or training. Another great idea is to write to your list when you are running a special or promotion that you feel would benefit them. To make those relationships even stronger, consider utilizing a CRM system, like the one included in the MLSP membership, so that you can take notes about your prospects, customers, and business partners. A CRM is an essential tool for keeping track of all of the new relationships you form so that you can more effectively follow up with people on an individual basis. You are able to keep track of all of the communication and interaction you had with that particular prospect which helps you better sift and sort through people in order to find those who are a perfect fit for your business. 6. Focus on emotion and storytelling over features When it does come to promoting your actual products or services, focus on storytelling. How did that product help you personally? What has the extra income specifically helped you achieve? People are emotional buyers. Rather than just talking about all of the product's features, which people have heard countless times, tug at your prospect's heartstrings. Show them how something will make them feel. Paint a visual and emotional picture of what your products and services can do for them. This will be far more effective and carries much more power than simply just listing off pre-scripted benefits. 
Thank you for watching this video, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your team members, also, to get the future video updates don't forget to subscribe my channel and turn on the bell icon.